Hey everybody, welcome to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Pauletta and I'm on a journey to lose 100 pounds. Um, in this video, obviously I'm doing my week one weigh-in, plus I put in some little bonus footage of what I ate during out the week. Granted, I'm not that consistent with recording what I ate during the week. Like, it's just something new to me. So it's just a couple of clips here and there of what I ate. And again, it's not perfect. Um, I'm starting off slow and easy, making small little lifestyle, cha lifestyle changes um, at a time. So what you're seeing that I'm eating may be something that you don't want to eat. Or you're saying, that's not healthy. Um, granted, it may not be as healthy as it should be, but I did make compromises. I did make changes in what I normally would do. Um, With that being said, here's my motivational slash inspirational quote for this video. Goals are individual, not universal. Just because someone can run further, lift heavier, go longer, doesn't mean your effort isn't just as valid. So work hard for you and your goals. Progress will come. Really, Andrew? Really? That was my best take. <laughs> um, one day I ate a sandwich. Instead of eating two sandwiches, I ate one. Um, I did go to In-N-Out two to three times. Yes? I made it protein style with no bun. There is one thing. There is one thing that, um, <laughs> that's one thing like I look at looking back, I don't want to go to fast food places at least more than once a week. Just to get that, you know, that feeling out the way, that, that greasiness. Other than that, I can make a burger at home. So that's one thing looking back on that I feel I need to change for next week and on. Um, once a week fast food and doing changes that way. Uh, what I did not take any footage of is what I drank during the week. So every day I had a cup of coffee for the most part. Um, there was two days when I went to work, I had... Um, Dutch Bros, a co-worker got for me. I got the lar I got a large ice keto americano. Normally, I get the 911, so I just figured, I guess, change. It. I don't really don't want know what the difference is, honestly, because I really don't drink Dutch Bros. Like Starbucks is my go-to. Like everybody loves Bucky's. But I had that, and then two days, um, beginning of the week, I had two an uh, energy drink. So I had two energy drinks so far, and um. Normally, I'd have an energy drink every day, maybe two like during my shift at work. So that's like a big change I made. Um, I also drink water, of course. Um, I carry around at work this gallon jug. Now for work, I most likely drink this whole thing. Um, I fill it up before I go to work and by the time I'm going like on my way home or something like that, I have, don't have much left so I can finish it off. But while I'm at home, that's a different story like I really don't drink a gallon of water I maybe drink I mean I drink water throughout the day like water bottles so I don't really know how many I drink at home but I know it's just not a gallon so that's something I want to work on is more of my water intake obviously um I did I took some notes okay because you hear pregnancy brain but like after you have a kid like I got mom brain like I know what I want to say I know what I want to do and then I forget like right away. So, um, thank you. Hey, thank you. I need that big boy right there. You, you see? Okay. You leaving? So, um, took a little bit of notes. I mean, I said I've done good. I said most part what most things I wanted to say. So you guys know <laughs> in one of my videos before that the baby took the remote to the TV. He didn't take the remote to the TV, but he did take the Bluetooth remote to my phone to, you know, capture the video and all. So hope he doesn't press that from a distance. I hope it doesn't work that far. Um, one other change I did do was like, um, I do want to incorporate like exercises, not right now. Like I was going to do start doing some yoga. But then I slept like super wrong on my arm. Like, I don't, I don't know, it hurts. So that's not gonna be happening, at least not this week, maybe next week. But thanks to my bullying coworker, I have not been taking the elevator at work. I took maybe once this week. 
and I because I knew he wasn't around. <laughs> Other than that, I'm taking the stairs. I work in a warehouse, so I, there's a lot of stairs to be taking, and I'm on my feet all night for the most part. So I'm not completely active, but I'm kind of you know in between, I guess you can say. Um, so I do want to. Um, bring up some kind of activity next week. I'm not sure why I'll go about that as. I know I do, like I said, I know I want to do some yoga. I may not do it every day, just when I have time or, you know, if I feel like I'm in the mood to do something, I'll do some yoga. I did buy some weights um, off of Amazon that I'm going to incorporate um, at home workouts. Other than that, now you're going to see what I ate during the week as well. Two weigh-ins. Uh, the first weigh-in is the weigh-in that was actually one week from when I did my measurements from the previous video. And then the second weigh-in was actually on that Sunday when I went to start. So um, I'm going to start weighing in every Sunday. I just did two extra weigh-ins in this video just because I weighed in day one early. Um, it's enough of me talking. If you made it this far of me talking all the... I talk, I talk a lot, obviously. Like, I talk... Yeah, like I was that kid that while I was in school, like I wasn't like a troublemaker, but I just never stopped talking. I get calls home saying, you know, Paletta, you know, excessive talking, blah, blah, blah. Like, yeah, I know, I know. So if you made it through far, this far in this video, please subscribe, um, like this video, comment down below if you're on any weight loss journey or what you ate during the week that you feel like you should change. Um, yeah, here we go. So like, Drew just came home and he was like, before he got here, he was like, you know, you want anything? And normally I'm like, I don't know, give me something, something, something to eat, something or whatever. But like, I didn't let him get me fast food, but I did have him get me something from a fast food place, coffee. And in a way it's kind of satisfying me feeling like I kind of got some fast food, but I didn't. And I mean, what are you doing? But um, yeah, I, I just said no and just gave me a coffee. I mean, I still got it regular, um, cream and sugar, seven and seven. To me, that's still progress, right? I didn't get large fries like I really wanted. Um, I'm just starting in. I'm not trying to have a cheat meal already. You know, like, you know, got to at least start off the first week reasonable, you know? But yeah, I just felt like I'd drop in and say that. So, see y'all uh, whenever I decide to pick up my phone again. So I'm just keeping things honest here. I'm about to make me a pastrami sandwich. I am using this white sub bread I got from Walmart. I only have two left, well, now one. Um, one thing I realized on a lot of the videos I've watched is that people, you know, say they are gonna throw out the bad food that's in their home. Um, I don't have it like that. I don't know what jobs or life they live to just throw out, you know, perfectly good food. Well, we got seven. Damn. But I don't have it like that. So, what is that? So, um, I'm gonna eat when I can. Uh, normally I probably have two of these sandwiches, to be honest. So, that's a step in my book. Um, yeah, I'm just gonna pop it in the air fryer, toast it up a bit, and then eat it. But I'm just keeping things so real with you guys because I'm I'm not gonna throw out all the well, I mean, all the good food that I still have in my house. Like, if it's not expired, I'm not throwing it away. It's gonna be eaten by one of us somehow one day. Um, I'm an adult. I control what goes in my body, so if I know I should have it. Or if I don't want it for the day, I'm not gonna eat it. But it's, I told you guys, like, I'm just gonna be doing baby steps with things. So, like I said, normally I'd have two of these sandwiches, right? And I'm just gonna have one. It's, and yes, I would eat two. Like, I'm not lying about that either. Um, I'm really not counting calories or anything, so yeah. Um, that's that. I don't have any sliced cheese, I don't think. Um, so, let's 
gotta improvise. But I mean, that's as well as it gets. Um, so that's my day one. This is my lunch. Throughout this week vlog, I'm just gonna, you know, show little meals here and there that I have. Me being brutally honest about what I'm eating every day. Like, there's no sugar coating here. Um, rather it's good or bad, I am gonna document it. May not document every meal, but it's like when I'm able to remember to pick up the camera, I will. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna jazz things up a bit too all the time. This is my sandwich. I'm going to pop it in the air fryer. And I'll get with you guys um, when it's done. That probably sounds so loud. I'm sorry. I'll get back to you guys when it's done. So, yeah. So it looks like right now. Simple. All right. Here is the end result. Just frozen broccoli that I put in the microwave and lamb chop. This is the other half. It was one, I just like cut it in half. So, yeah. There we go. Quite delicious. So, I'm picking up some breakfast for me and the family. Got some sausage. Some frozen bell peppers I just pop in the microwave. It's just so I do put it on the skillet because I like the water. And then I'm going to make some eggs over hard. And um, that's what's going on right now. Hey y'all, <clears throat> sorry. It's September 1st, I'm on my way to work. I figured as I am doing these couple glimpses of what I'm eating through the day, I'd show my face so you guys don't think I'm trying to cheat the system. So I'm bringing to work um, just some bell peppers, sweet bell peppers, two um, cut up mozzarella sticks, cheese sticks, and like three slices of turkey meat. And, um, also one of the premier protein this is the coffee one so yeah on to work can't record in work but i may um if i go to the car on my break or something i may say hey i don't know but on my way to work over here he's you know snacking on stuff got food on the floor don't mind that
How are y'all? It's exactly a week from when I took my photos and did my weigh in. So it's Thursday the 2nd. I'm about to get ready for work, but I figured I'd do this quick video um, and just hop on my scale just so you guys see what the week number is and then the extra days for Sunday. All right. All right, here is a snack. Probably should consider this like a meal. I'm not quite sure. Um, a ugly looking apple, some pastrami slices, and one string cheese. I'm gonna like start filling out stuff in my journal right now and like downside from one notebook to another and stuff and watch some YouTube. So just keeping it real y'all. I'm gonna eat what I have at home and I'm gonna make it work. Hey everybody, it is Sunday, September 5th. I just woke up, so I figured I'd get on the scale now and see where I'm at. And so, uh, yeah, here it goes. Switch this around. 